how's everyone doing today and stuff like that how are you how are you i hope you're having a lovely day today and welcome back to another episode of cult of the lamb so in today's episode uh, i want to just i want to take it a little slow i want to take it a step back back and we're gonna do some decoration we're gonna make sure that all our cult members are feeling well i'd love to upgrade the sleeping quarters uh, and we're gonna use the tent today because i definitely did not forget at all last episode um that's a lie I, I i partially forgot last episode so basically i discussed with switch chat hey i don't think we should use it yet we should wait until we have two followers with the trait lustful to make sure that we do get a follower out of it uh, and then we never got one and i just forgot to explain it on camera so you know what it happens it happens the good news oh that's not good news um <laughs> that was a little um <laughs> Th that came in a little bit of a wrong moment of me saying the good news, didn't it? Well, <laughs> um, the good news, right, is that uh, the follower that's right there, we actually already checked him out on what kind of traits he has. Uh, also has the lustful trait. And we actually have somebody who wants to be that follower as well. So let's just get right into that so that we can start with whatever today's plan bring, huh? We've got Old Fox Michael right here. We've got the traits, uh, Natural Skeptic, uh, Hindu Hinduist. I don't, I don't know how to pronounce that. And we have Lustful. So we're gonna, we're gonna take this follower, and we're gonna take Counterpy as a follower. We're gonna take Fox and Counterpy, and we're gonna go. You can do, just go do whatever. And we're gonna go see if we have enough sin to actually add them to the tent. Let's see. Do we? Yeah, we have one out of one sin. Okay, all right then. Uh, let's just get into that. We have Count Derby right here. And we have... Old Fox Michael. Oh, you can actually also see their the heart moving. Oh, okay. So, so some of them have better relationship. All right. Count Derby has lost full trait. Does... Count Derby and Gigi have a very high... Have a very uh, high rate together. Uh, but they do both have lustful trait, and it does seem to stack. So, um, let's just see what that does, shall we? Let's just see. I don't know if that means success or not. Uh, random traits. Okay, so we can pick... We can pick traits, then. Decreases predictivity by 10%, but increases sin generation. Um... Heals faster in bed rest. Generates 20% uh, faster when wearing a unique outfit. We don't have that many unique outfits. So what if we go with Lustful? Oh, we, we can only pick Lustful once. We can't, have, we can't just do double Lustful. And let's pick... Um, I think we pick Strong Stomach as well. When sick and in bed rest. Though we don't really have followers getting sick that much. I just don't want the predictiv productivity decrease. However, that does mean we have a good sin generation, basically. But we already currently have Lux as sin generation. And I'm not... I'm assuming Lux won't die that fast. We also just had Old Fox Michael join with sin generation. So, um... Let's go with that. Alright. Egg. And now they're exhausted. <laughs> Please go to bed. Please go to bed. You guys can go to bed. Are you going to bed already? Here. Go to bed. Mm. Alright, so now we have this egg. We can pick it up or we can crack it. Uh, I think we're supposed to put it in a hatchery. Right? Uh, I don't know if we have a hatchery. Is it in faith? It is. Hatchery. We can make it right now. So let's just get to that. I think the hatchery can be... The hatchery can, can be... Right there. Because then it's next to the nursing station, it's next to the sleeping quarters, and it's next to the food station, right? That seems like a half-decent place for hatchery. So we're gonna build it. Uh, Chi-Chi's level up. Uh, we're gonna do that in a moment. Hatchery done. Let's level up Chi-Chi. Just before we forget, right? There we go. And then we put the egg in, I'm assuming. Let's put the egg in. Pick up. Don't accidentally crack it. I wouldn't be surprised if, if I would do that by accident by pressing the wrong button. Uh, fill. Tend to. Okay, we tend to take care of the egg. Alright! Happy egg! Hello, Lux? Lux just runs away again. Uh, let's, let's, let's reassure her for a moment. 
I think that might also level Lux up. If not, we can do a quick dance right here. Let's do a quick dance. Inspire. And level 20. There we go. Uh, that's all good. Before we before we do our ceremony and stuff, like getting people to level up is fantastic. Um, I guess we now just wait on this egg to hatch. Uh, and I think I'm going to do a drum circle real quickly. And I really want to do some decoration today. So we've got enough to do today. It's going to be a good day. There we go. Send generation complete. Get another sin out. There we go. Ooh. What have you done to me? Yeah, what have I done? But I see, I see that there is a... I mean, I, I'll uh, find you the next life and punish you for this. Wait, what? You greed it for sin and it has damned me. Oh no! Have I, have I sinned too much? Oh! Secret outfit disc- Oh, I wasn't reading that! Because I thought- Acquired fancy robes. I, uh... You know, I try not to kill the followers. I I, re I really try not to kill the followers, but I guess if 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 I make them sin like three times, they just um yeah. Listen, the cult is getting smaller, and it's not all my fault. Okay, it's not all my fault. Only some of it is my fault. <laughs> all right, so Riven has a quest right here. Hello, what is your quest? We have been uh talking, and uh we are tired of the food here. We need uh, some variation, please. Would you make us some fish dishes? We can do the ocean bounty ritual. That's completely fine. I was just repairing these, and I think I'm gonna upgrade one of the one of these two actually, if we have the stuff for it. Cause well, you know, it it's good it's good to get the level twos out just so that we can uh, make sure that we actually have a backlog of stuff to make. Cause we are very much close to having no stone currently. Uh, then I guess we're just gonna do the ocean bounty ritual while I do a ceremony in a little bit, and it will all be good. So I just had my fishing trip, and I decided to get. I'm, I'm gonna decide to give 350 gold to the statue. I genuinely don't think that it's worth it or that it's gonna pay out. Uh, but we might as well try, because I just wanna see if anything happens, really. Uh. Uh, the gods of the uh, of the gold are con uh, centering your offering. Come back in three days. Well, I'm glad I did it at, at the start of the recording because I guess we'll see later. I guess we will see later then. So the egg is going to need some more care. I don't know when it's going to hatch. So I'm just going to show you every time I give the egg some care. Uh, then we are also going to level up right here. There we go. Divine Inspiration unlocks. What are we going to unlock? We can go for hatchery too, but that seems a little... Um, optimistic right like we just we just we just put in our first egg in the hatchery so getting hatchery two seems a little optimistic we could go for drinking house and just have some fun right but i think we need something currently a little more mm, i was gonna say useful and then i saw the decorations because i kind of i kind of really want to work on decorating the cult today uh let's go with trap scarecrow that may seem very random from what i just said but it's something that I've been wanting to upgrade for a while. It's going to give us a slight bit of extra food source. And it's something that we can upgrade to the farm. Thank you, Ganderby, for contributing to the totem. It's something we can upgrade to the farm. Uh, and make everything run a little bit better, I guess. We also still need to add extra, like, farming plots here. I don't think I'm going to put an extra house down here. Because it's it, that seems a little useless. Uh, but we will see. I'm going to go upgrade the tents to, uh, to the communal tents. So we can shave off a bit here and make a nice little section around this tent uh, we're gonna do some decoration i'm excited i'm excited pet 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 all right so one of the followers we didn't name just died um i think i actually kind of want to harvest him for meat because well like we don't know this follower right we kind of just added him because we needed followers I'm, I'm not too attached to him we have limited space like like we're quite full so I think we will just dump him in the morgue for now. We can't, because we prepared for burial. Um, can we still... Oh, we can't. We can't. Okay, so we can't make him into meat anymore? I thought we still could. Can we pull him out? Can we pull him out? Okay. Alright. Uh, well, I didn't mean to do that. I guess... Um, I guess um, that that's it then. I, I He didn't need to be in here, but oh well. Alright. Okay, fine then. 
Anyway, uh, I have petted the egg a few times. I've made this little lovely corner. It's not fully done yet. I want to do some more decoration around the cult, basically. Uh, but this will be it for now before we go into a level. Because, well... We're running low on resources. We have 33 gold. We have, uh, we have enough stone and wood to make more, basically, here. Make more stairs and stuff like that. We're just... We're just running slowly but steadily kind of low on things. So I want to make sure that we go into a level before we are super low on everything. But before we do that, that, right, I wanted to do a ceremony. Right, I have so many things to do. So we do a ceremony. I don't think this is going to level us up. But I'm hoping. No, it's not. All right. Um, then there's other things I want to do here. Because otherwise I wouldn't, have, I wouldn't have brought you here if uh, this was the only thing. We're going to break a stone. Uh, we're going to go into crown. We're going to go break a stone. We only have two more stones left to break. So, uh, let's see. We will go with Law and Order. And we'll do Sin last. Uh, face through, uh, version of Faith through donation. Loyalty enforcements. Perform a ritual at your, uh, temple in which you, uh, appoint a follower, uh, as your, uh, uh, loyalty enforcer. Tasked with patrolling the cult and raising the loyalty of your followers. Perform a ritual at your temple in which you, uh, appoint a follower as your tax enforcer task with uh, collecting money from uh, from other cult members. Let's do loyalty enforcer. Because uh, listen. Listen, right? We do need money, but this just this just sounds a little kinder than taking people's money, right? And we already have the ritual where we give out money. And, and I think they can do fun things with that money, right? Even though they are just in our cult, and I don't see what they could do in our cult with, you know, just our money. But it's fine. It's fine. We should have probably broken the stone before we uh, did the cult, because, like, there's a level up now and stuff like that. They've also... Uh, that other follower has also gone old, so... Uh, we've got lots of old followers, we're gonna have lots of death. And, and I think it's a good idea if we indeed do go out. We're gonna make some demons, we go out, and... Uh, we we do a level, and we get some loot. Uh, it, this will be a rerun, I will probably show you the bosses and what starting weapon we get, like usual. Uh, but besides, I'm gonna clean up the last little bits of my cult, and we're gonna head out. Uh, Jonathan Joestar apparently has a quest for us. Hello. Leader, could you uh, collect uh, some spider silk? Uh, sure, but I wasn't planning on rerunning that level. Um, but I guess we can try rerunning that level. Because, uh, well, that's going to be a rough level to rerun. We're definitely going to need some... Uh, what is it? demons then but we are also at seven cult members right now for which two are old so is that really worth it i guess we can give it a try right oh we forgot that we didn't watch the door open yet well there is the door not planning on going in there today to be completely honest with you uh we're we're right now heading out to the spider quest how much are you 50 uh it's a little much we're going out to the spider right now because, like, we need to collect some silk for uh, for the quest. I got two demons with me. We only have so many cult members right now, so we gotta just make sure that we collect some followers on this route. And um, that is the plan, basically. Oh, you are here. Oh, you're always here. You're just talking to us. Hello. Uh, some of uh, now smited since uh, since time uh, immemorial has their presence weighed heavy upon the beast within. Their worshipper both be well uh, versed in in the art of war making. Pretty uh, move uh, move with the care. Sharp teeth teeth dots doth not equant to quick death. Yes. Okay. All right. I just want my weapons. I just wanted to say that I got. Ooh, we got a good sword. We got a poison sword, and we get the flaming thing. I just want to say we have the cloak so that we do half damage. But we uh, do more damage with our blasts. And we have more, like, blast stuff to save. So I'm going to try that. And why I took that with me to the spider area is because I want to stay. I want to stay at range, basically. Like, I want to stay as far away from things as possible. Uh, now, I know that's a healer. But we did so much damage that we just killed him. All right. We also got a follower that makes it so that the favor comes more easily towards us. So I think this is a good combination. We're going to see how far we get. Let's hope we at least get to the boss. Uh, I don't think this is a looping run. But it's definitely a boss we haven't done yet. And that we can give a heart to the ship guy. for, Or I. The eye of the witness. Oh. Oh no. 
The suffering you have caused me, it is uh, unbearable. You did this to me. Oh no. Lux, I didn't mean to. I didn't re I didn't know that like I didn't know that doing that three times would make you would make you like screwed up in the head, okay. I didn't know. <laughs> I didn't do it on purpose. We also have so little health, by the way. Like what happened to her to her max health? What happened to her max health? Where did it go? Is that also a thing of the fleece? Did I not read it properly? Um Okay. Acquired follower arch. Yeah, nice, I guess. <laughs> Anyway, if any more crazy things like that happen in this level, I will let you know. But besides that, it it was supposed... It's gonna be a calm level, I hope. So we died. Uh, it didn't go well at all. At least we got the 10 spider silk for the quest. Uh, I wonder where my half HP comes from. If that was also the cloak or if something happened that we now just permanently have half HP. Um, no, we have full HP here. So maybe... Oh yeah, we also had somebody die again. But this is, this is another cult member that I should have made into food. Yeah. Or at least into follower meat. Um, it didn't. It didn't go well. Listen, it went. It went really horrible. It went. It went really horrible. Um, <laughs> I'm um uh, I'm not so sure what to um. Oh, the egg has a little. The egg has a little eye. Go to sleep. Uh, <laughs> complete your quest and go to sleep. <laughs> Here, go to sleep. Uh, the egg has a little eye. It's a uh, hatch egg. We can hatch the egg. Let's go. All right, here you. Hello, hello. All right, so we can give it a name, and the name is gonna be Ari. Uh, we can't, we can't select uh, what Ari will look like. Uh, though, though maybe later, indeed, maybe later, because Ari wanted to. Ari wants to be a uh, white fox, but also wants to be uh, the new follower, basically. So we will see. We will see if we can change that. They're, they don't seem to be grown up yet. No, no, they're definitely not grown up yet. Okay. Okay. You have a new uh, follower, your flock grows. Great. Great. <laughs> we got an achievement. Cook, a, fo uh, cook a, a follower meat meal. Wait, what? Did we cook a... F Did I select the wrong meal? Did I select the wrong meal? What, what do you have out here? What kind of food do you have out here, huh? I definitely I a follower meat wheel wait 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 what did we cook? We didn't cook the deadly dish, I know we didn't do that. I think we just cooked the hearty broth, right? I don't know what we cooked. I know I know that like it doesn't anything that's laying here doesn't look like it's it's bad meat, right? Listen, today isn't going great. Today, I'm gonna buy a follower, right? We're gonna buy a follower from the spider, because, well... We, we have to, kind of thing. How expensive is it right now? 50, yeah, uh, here, half my money. Half, half my money. And I'm gonna ask if anyone in Twitch chat wants to join, otherwise this will be uh, Lux 3.0. I, I didn't mean to kill Lux. I'm I'm getting desperate, okay? We're gonna we, we're gonna do a rerun of a level, and I think we're just gonna do a basic level. Uh, look at the flower. Uh, yeah, I think we're gonna just do a basic level, and uh, we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> All right, so we have Lux three right here. I've given Lux a skull necklace because we really gotta have our follower survive a little bit longer. Um, uh, don't ask what happened to Lux two, Lux three. You don't want to know, and you will never know. Anyway, let's do another drum circle in a moment so we can generate some more sin, right? Because, you know, that's, uh, that's good, right? <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm gonna do another drum circle, generate some sin. We're gonna do another ceremony. I think it might be time to actually head back to the Midas's cave. And, um, I'll see you back from the Midas's cave, or I'll see you there. And then we will go on another, we'll go on another repeat level, but we won't go to the spider one this time, because the spider one is currently a death sentence for us. And we do level up, actually, so I guess this bit continues, huh? Um, let's see, what are we gonna level up? Seeing as I wanna stay, uh, I wanna keep the cloak on that I currently have, we're gonna go with Curse of the Tundra, which adds three new curses. Uh, and I just wanna see, I just wanna see what kind of curses they are, so I'm gonna add that. 
Uh, I wanna I wanna stay with this cloak because I think this cloak can genuinely be really fun. Just maybe not in the spider level immediately, you know? Search your child. You can't see it. Oh you can't. Oh. Ooh, instant level up. That's great. I didn't expect that to do that. Well that's great. That means that we might actually have a really good follower uh, if if this becomes one of those. I'm only saying if because I'm very worried that somehow every cult member is going to die today. Alright, so we're here at the Midas Cave. Let's withdraw whatever money is in here. Uh, the gold, uh, the go uh, gods of gold accepted your offering. 450 coins. Nice, we actually, we actually got more, like, quite a bit of money back. You know what? I, I'm not going to put more money in currently because I actually really need my money for if we find a spider that we need to pay followers from. Because we genuinely need a lot more followers, so... Um, I'm, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to put my money back in. But I am going to go out into a level now. Uh, I forgot that we don't have any demons currently. Do I go out into a level without demons? The problem is it makes our follower tired, right? Oh, you can actually see the eyes of the witness that we've collected. Like, they're there. That one is there, and that one is there. We just... You can actually see that. That's pretty cool. Um... Yeah, we're gonna get some demons, because the demons do speed up the levels. And if we do have the demons, that means that, like... I don't know. It speeds up the levels, and it makes sure that, like... We can do more loops, I think, basically. I also found out what some of these, um... Can I please harvest the thing? There we go. Uh, what some of these, like, extra fertilizer do. The blue one gives us devotion straight away, like this. Uh, that's why I've not harvested them. And there is the red ones over here... Uh, those, they attract the flies at night, so that we can easily collect stuff. Anyway, I, f I found that out. Stop pooping everywhere. Stop pooping everywhere. Uh, so I'm gonna turn two more people into followers. I think we're just gonna grab the same group we just had, because... Well, they did well, besides that I did bad, basically. So we got our demon followers now, we got our cloak, let's go in. And let's see what we get, shall we? I also saw, I just heard that something sad happened, so I, I hope no one just died, right? Uh, maybe. No, okay. Uh, Divine Blizzard knocks back enemies and freezes enemies. Okay. And we get an axe. We get a critical axe. Okay. Alright, yeah, we do have half health still, so I think this cloak might actually give us half health, and I think I just read the fleece wrong. Oh, well. Um, half health is gonna be rough. But I can sure try my best. I wouldn't be surprised if we die again. Because oh, holy boy, holy boy, that went not well. Um, I will see you. This is going to be a level I'm definitely going to need to be focusing on things. And otherwise, I might just pick up the other fleece again because the other fleece did way better for us. Uh, curses deal double damage and cost half the favor, but melee weapons, uh, weapon damage is half and health are half. Oh, oh, all right then. We need to go follow her. Like, because we need followers. We we also need health, but we need followers. Like, that's why we're here. Oh, it's one of you. Listen. I'm surrounded by fools that don't see my, uh, genius, but... You see it, don't you, lamb? Admit your stu uh, stupidity and my, uh... <laughs> yes, I am a fool. Perhaps you are not as stupid as you look. I am. Like, listen, we, we need followers. We need followers. I will gladly say I am a fool because we need followers. <laughs> All right. So I want to share for a bit what cards we have currently. We only have two cards. Enemies will drop two times more favor and 10% uh, chance of uh, gaining a, uh, a blue heart when killing an enemy. That is actually really good. We also have a... Uh, I don't know what it's called. I think it's like artifact thing that spawns a higher level curse every time we use it. Which is really good, right? Because, like, right now our entire build is kind of curse-related. Uh, problem! Like, our curse our curse basically one-shots things currently. Like, it's really strong. Problem is, our health is still really low. Uh, that's from number one. From number two... Uh, I kind of wanted this to be a looping run, but we just had somebody die in the cult. From number three, our health is really low. So... I don't know if this is going to be a looping run, but I really want it to be a looping run. But look at the damage we do, though. 
Yeah, I also indeed, I did understand the fleece wrong. Uh, the fleece does half our health. That is normal. Um, but I can't see why, because like staying at a distance and using the curses is really strong. Uh, I'm just a little worried because I haven't fought most of these bosses yet, or the upgrades. This is actually the first time we're fighting the upgrade frog, I think. Uh, we are currently doing pretty well, as I think that this is a relatively easy-ish boss. Uh, but it's definitely one of those things where... Uh, if, if we do want to loop, I am going to heavily need to rely on my curse. And we're going to have to hope that we do get some soul hearts from uh, the card that we have, basically. Because the next boss might not go this well. The next boss might not go as well. Or we just get that boss that keeps summoning stuff and it's going to go fine. Anyway, uh, that was the boss. Are we going to do a looping run? I want to follow her form just because. Oh, look how cute it is. Oh, that's super cute. That might be my next follower. That might be my next follower. I, I think we're going to go on a looping run. We genuinely need more followers. We just had a, pe a person die. A people die. We just had a person die. The chance that we have someone else die is pretty high, to be completely honest with you. So we're going on a looping run. We're gonna... We're just... We're trying to gain some loot here. We're trying to make sure that our cult can at least be up to 10 people. Alright. Ari was neglected for a day. Oh, I didn't mean that. I didn't... I didn't know. I didn't know. Oops. Alright, so we didn't mean to neglect Ari, but at least we can buy some clothing. Right? <laughs> Make ourselves feel a little better, maybe? Let's see. Acquired... Oh, a green dress. Oh, that's nice. It's just a regular thing. And you're gonna run out of clothes. That's fine. I'll give you some time to make some new clothes. I'll give you some time. And I'll take all your loot again, because why not? Uh, then we're gonna go on to the next one, and the next one should have a follower for us. Let's see... Okay, it is a follower level where we have to battle. So we're gonna use our invincibility. It shouldn't be too hard, though, because our invincibility actually lasts really long. Uh, so we can do invincibility. And then basically kill things. It also does a lot of damage currently. So, um... We basically got it recharged before, uh... There we go. We got it fully recharged. It's, it's a fun combo like this. It's a really fun combo. I am very tempted to not upgrade my uh, my thing anymore and stay with the invincibility. Because doing that and then killing things, it's so easy. Like, it feels a little broken. But, you know, maybe we'll get a higher level. One that does even more damage, right? Hello, I think it's Capybara, right? Welcome. Come join our cult. We need it. We need you. We need you more than you think. And then we're going to go into a level where we take double damage, but we also do double damage. Let's, uh... I hope that goes well. But we will only see when we do it. So we arrive at the next boss fight. Um, luckily, we've got our invincibility stuff, basically. Because I want to do this one really fast. Because uh, it's the next night, basically. And I don't want Ari to get another day of neglection. Right? We, we don't need anyone to take Ari away, right? basically. Uh, but I do not like finding this boss that much because he, he goes too far out of the level when we hit him multiple times. We can still clearly be hit by poison while we are invincible. So that does make him a little harder. Uh, but we're just we're just going to go full force. Just get all the damage out that we can and just go for it. Mainly because we have to. I want to I wanna complete this boss fight before it's daytime. Because if we don't complete this boss fight before it's daytime, Ari might, Ari might get upset. There we go. So we're not looping again, even though we've got some really killer cards for looping currently. And definitely with this build. Because we've got so many combinations of getting extra, like... Do you see there? We, we are still at 10. Or 10 are of our shield. I'm going to choose the gold nuggets because I want them uh, to make them into gold. There we go. Uh, and we're leaving. And we're leaving pretty fast. We also get invincibility right on entering a room, as you could just see. We, we just had a really good, like, collection of stuff. We do get a good amount of resources. We get another skull necklace, which I'm really happy about. Because that is... Uh, that's one of those things that makes sure that followers stay alive longer. And I'm gonna just start dropping them onto people, basically. Alright. We are here. Ari. Ari, I'm here to make sure that you're not neglected. Uh, where are you, Ari? Are you in... Are you... Here, speak. Pet. Are we gonna get another full level up? 
We are. Holy moly, that means that we can, like, uh, like when they're small, we can get them up. We, we missed one level because we, we neglected it. We neclected our for one day. Uh, we can get some really good levels then right at the start. Uh, you should go to sleep. You should go to sleep too. I get that you were eating, but you should go to sleep. Alright, so you can see our, our plants with our special fertilizer. We don't need to harvest it. It doesn't need to be harvested. Um, I think the plan is... I'm gonna go buy another follower from that spider, if the spider has another follower. And one that's not ill, because the other one was ill and that I... I need followers that can work currently. Uh, no, you don't seem ill. 50 coins, I'll take it. And, uh, we're gonna add some... We're gonna add some, uh, some cult members. Uh, we're gonna add three cult members, in fact. Uh, I think we're just gonna go through... Uh, more games needs to be added, and it can be added back in. Like, my own follower. Uh, we can also add... Oh yeah, you're still dead. Oops. Um, I, I, I forgot. Uh, I, I, I forgot. I forgot that you were dead. Sorry. More games can still be added. Uh, I will add Goten as well, my other cat. And um, besides that, full, full, uh, full, uh, not full. Okay. <laughs> uh, and besides that, I don't know who the last one is going to be. It might just be the random follower being added to the cult. But we will see. We will see. At least we'll be up to 10. That's the goal. So we have Goten added right here. Let's go collect stone. We're going to add more games next. All right, so more games is right here. There we go. I forgot to give Goten a necklace, actually. I'm not giving more games a necklace. Uh, you can work at the infirmary because nobody else wants to work there, so you can work there. Where's Ari? There's Ari. Uh, take care. It's going to get another full level, maybe? Yeah, geez, that's good. That's really good. That is really good. So Jonathan Joestar has another quest today. Let's hope it's anything better than uh, going to the spider place. Um, recruit uh, 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 sending uh, followers. Sure. Sure. We can, we can, we can recruit more followers. We can recruit more followers. That's good, actually. That's good. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to call this follower yet. Uh, we're just going to add them as they are. I'm not going to give them any life plus or anything like that. They do have the royal pooper again. Um, yeah, you can just be added. It's good that you have sin generation because we don't want to... Apparently, we don't want to sin generate too much in one person. Um, go do whatever. And you will be all added as well. We're just we're just adding followers right now. We, we got to add followers, basically. And you are descending. Uh, so you go to jail. <laughs> what a lovely, what a lovely time are we having, right? That does mean that we complete the quest, I think. Yeah, there we go. Quest complete. You can do it. You are up to level three. That's perfect. We're trying to get everybody up a few levels or a little bit before going into, uh, into church, basically. And I think currently that's going really well. Uh, we gotta re-educate. We also gotta re-educate, make sure that that goes well. And Ari is walking right now. Ari has gone from just crawling around to walking. This is going well. This is going well. I uh, I gotta add some more seeds to the thing. You know, I think I think that we're doing better. We are still struggling on the amount of seeds that we have. Like seeds is genuinely an issue. They're also quite hard to get in levels besides the the mincing mushroom seeds. Um, we once again upgraded our little. Uh, our little area right here, I've added the pond. We've added some pink trees, right? It's becoming a nice... It's becoming a nice place. It's becoming a nice place. Uh, besides... I know that this episode is a little bit chaotic. Like, we're just kind of running back and forth. Today has really been a day of... What do I need to do in the cult? And it's been a lot about the cult members of just... Of just seeing what's going on, basically, right? Uh, I am gonna check if we can upgrade our temple. Oh, Jonathan has another quest. <laughs> Leader, my brother and I were traveling together to the dark woods. Sure, we can do a level through the dark woods. Uh, problem is, indeed, we can't abandon Ari for too long. We need to make sure that Ari stay, that we are staying together with Ari, so that uh, Ari can get all the things that uh, Ari needs. Um, we're gonna upgrade. We're gonna upgrade this. We've got two sin. Why not? Let's go. Let's go for the upgrade. Let's see what changes. 
Ooh, we get statue. We get a statues of us in the corner. They look a little silly. But um, another upgrade for the cult. Aesthetics. We can choose aesthetics. I don't know how to unlock these. But we can go with this one. Which is the one that we have selected right now. But I'd rather go with that one. That one looks lovely. Look at our little temple. Oh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. Do it. Does it look different from the outside? Oh. Yeah, we got little flowers around it. Oh, and we get a... That doesn't... <laughs> we look so friendly until you look at the eye, right? That's great. That's great. Ari, why are you sleeping on the floor? Why are you sleeping on the floor? Look, this is what I meant with all the flies kind of collect around it. Like that. It's kind of nice. And I think if we actually harvest all of the devotion from these plants, uh, we might have a level up. And we do. All right, then. All right. We have enough money to buy some seeds. So I might actually do that. Uh, I'm going to check out what we're going to do for a level up. And uh, well, we will see, basically. Actually, the choice wasn't that hard on what to upgrade. We're going to go with the lumber yard. Uh, and I want to go with the stone one next. I just want to get these simple upgrades out of the way that can just give us more basic resources, even though we have less followers uh, currently. Uh, let's see, can we upgrade them directly or do we need to wait for them to break down? Uh, they do seem to be an upgrade. So can we do the second one as well? We can't because we're out of wood. All right. Okay, uh, we're going to upgrade that. We can set up some wood. It's not like, once again, it's not like we don't have any wood. I just keep forgetting to set it up. So we're going to do that. We're going to set up some stone. I'm going to build this alone, I guess, because it's nighttime. And, um... I, uh... We'll see. We'll see what the next plan is. I think we're going to do a rerun in the, uh... In the Dark Woods. So that uh, Jonathan Joestar will be happy. And, uh... I think that might be it for this episode. I know that might be short or that it might still be long, to be honest with you. Every time I think it's a short episode, it's a... It's still an incredibly long episode. Um, but the plan today was really get the cult up to speed, get everything uh, ready, and, uh, baby Ari has a quest. Baby Ari, we're almost done. We're almost done. There we go. What are you, what is up? I'm so grateful to have, uh, spent my childhood in this perfect community, uh, now I devote myself to you. Aww! Alright, so this is where we can customize Ari. We're gonna give Ari, uh, the skull necklace. And, and I'm gonna do the rest real quickly, and we'll all be good. All right, so we got Ari right here. We've updated the colors. There was a plant in the way, but you can see it now. They got the skull necklace. It's a white wolf and already level four and just going to work, basically. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. Can we can we make you a proper a proper follower yet? Reeducate. You're not going to do a Sammy, right? And you're going to be good, right? Yeah. Yeah, there wasn't a little bit left over. Uh, release. There we go. There we go. All right, I'm going to get ready to go to the Dark Woods. And um, we're going to turn some followers into demons. And it's all going to be good. It's all going to be good. So we're going into the Dark Woods, basically. We've got Claws right now. I also am bringing Ari and uh, Jonathan Joestar. Because those are those are the followers with the highest levels. Uh, Jonathan will pick up Favor for us from the floor, basically. Which I think will actually go really well with us doing... Oh... Lux, can you not? Is this gonna happen every single time? Lux, can you not? Can you not? Uh, so we do more damage uh, with our curse than we do with uh, with our weapon, basically. But the Icar doesn't do that much damage is kind of the problem. It does a nice amount of damage, but it does damage when they keep standing on it. So it's not that great currently. Uh, we also have our half health, like... Uh, you know, we would uh, we would because of this cloak. Uh, it, it's go it's going great. It's going great. So I'm expecting to lose quite a little bit of health at the start of the level, but as we as we get better at using the Icker uh, and using the claws together in combination, I, I think we're gonna do fine. Yes, the half health is a little rough, but it's a level we've done before. We are here to get like a friend from Top Joe, get another skull necklace. Those are the things that we want to see. Those are definitely the things we want to see. So we're going to do the level. I'll see you at the boss fight. All right. So we're here for Jonathan, uh, for Jonathan's Joestar's brother. Now, if anyone actually does know Joestar, uh, Jojo, let me know if Jonathan Joestar actually has a brother. 
And I think it would be really funny to make it that, like, we just add this other JoJo character. Otherwise, I think we do need to stick with the theming for a moment for this one and for the quest. We should add another JoJo character. From this, I don't know any JoJo characters. So if you know any JoJo characters, please let me know. Please let me know in the comments or in chat or anything like that. And uh, we will add another we will add another JoJo character. But that will be next episode's problem. Let's listen to you. I wasn't expecting to see you anymore. And definitely not in these uh, levels. Bonds of uh, f uh, familiar. Duty turned instead, of, uh, instead to chains. Most thrones of uh, appetites cr crumbed and contained. Most infectious of ideas cut off and uh, uh, ca ca cauterized. So, I, I really like this owl. Once again, I really like this owl, but my dyslexia does not like this owl. Before given a uh, chance to rot and spread. Cruel, uh, cruel. Uh, verily, alas. What other resources was given? How does one kill death? One cannot. Alright, and we get a letter. Uh, offering to the owl. A prayer to the hunter. Great hunter, rewrite this prayer uh, and leave this offering. In hopes you uh, will grant us a triumphant in, uh, in our hunt. We vow to take uh, no more than we need. And we leave the, uh, the br uh, brooding and uh, the young. May, uh, may we be swift and silent as you hunt. Lore unlocked. Unlocked lore, locked lore. Okay. Well. Did we find his brother in the end? I need to check that right now. Because there is a quest, right? Um, the relic. The one who waits. Um, oh. Find a relic from... Uh, from Cubius Clues. I don't know what to, what that is. I don't know what that is, but like I I also don't know. I also I have the clues still screenshotted, but I don't know. I don't, I can't find it basically. So if anyone in the comment section has any tips, uh, please do, because that's one of those quests that I would actually like to complete, but I don't I don't really know where to start. Also, we have invincibility when we go into a room. It's great. It's great. We're having a good time. Ugh, can you please stop? Can you please stop showing up? Can you please stop showing up? Is that it? Oh! We get the sin out. And Lux is back to normal and going to her go- Oh no, now we have Lux 2 and Lux 3. Well, I can explain, right? You were not replaced. It was an accident, okay? Okay. We made it to the boss fight, and we do get this guy, which is... He's relatively easy. He's kind of fine, to be honest with you. And definitely with 10 of these. Like, we, we gotta use it when he's on the floor, though. Because because otherwise, our uh, our homing shots get a little bit confused. There we go. Look at how much damage our homing shots do. We're definitely in a level that is a little bit too easy for our current, uh, for our current levels. There we go. I think next time, we might want to rerun Kalamar's level. Uh, I am taking a Sin. Because uh, apparently, we, apparently we won't, don't want to take too much sin for our followers, even if they uh, do come back after we kill them in the level a few times. Uh, but that went really well. We did it really fast. So I'm going to move on and we're going to do a loopy loop. Loopy loop. You know, I'm getting really tired of reading you. We just chose a question mark floor and we find him again. He just leaves though. Okay, I guess he's done. All right, I guess I guess he's done. Once again, I really enjoyed his text. It's just, it's just very tiring for my brain to read. All right, so we found the boss floor, but we also finally found this guy again, and we actually have enough money to give him without stealing his money. So let's see what happens. My mouse is on screen. Oh, he just gives us a bunch of stuff. Uh, the statue rewards uh, an ambush and food. Can we do it again? Oh, that's actually quite nice. Um, that's actually great. And then we're just going to steal his money. Now it gets upset. I don't know if it's going to just take our food back that we just gave it. Um, but we can take its money. It's now upset. 
We're not making an art offering. Uh, let's go do the boss fight. Uh, I think this might be the first time we're actually going to be doing a triple loop. Because we've been we've been going genuinely really fast through these. We're also doing so much... Da oh, it didn't die. I was really hoping we could kill it in one, in one like, summoning thing. But we didn't kill it. Very close. Uh, I think the Dark Woods is a little bit too low of level for us now. Like, we're having a really easy time. Uh, but you know what? That's good for... Sometimes it's good to just have an easy time for a little bit. It makes it so that we can actually stock up our cult on supplies. Because we really needed some. Uh, and we're even gaining actually a lot of money. Uh, so I'm going to do one more loop. And that will be our final loop for today. Because uh, I don't think I've ever done a triple loop. Uh, but I'm hoping we get some cool stuff. There's a bunch of question marks that I'll definitely be going to. We just went into a question mark level and we got Ratu here. I know that rhythm. The sturdy beat of that heart. It could only be mine. Wayward heart, return uh, at last. Crusader, the hollow of my chest uh, yearns for reunion. May I? Yes. Yes, Ratu. Wait, our follower just went there? Oh, oh, I'm happy and I'm sad. I weep and I laugh and I love. Thank you, Crusader, for that, uh, what you have done. Wait. Uh. Did we just gain a permanent half a heart? Uh, well, say hello for me, won't you? Um. Did we just, did we just sacrifice Ari into Ratu? Or did Ari by any chance just fly that way at the same time? Um, Ari, I am so sorry if we just sacrificed you into Ratu. Um, Ari, listen, right? We can make you another fox follower. We can make you another fox. We can make you another white wolf follower. If I just sacrificed you into Ratu, I am so sorry. I didn't expect that to happen. Um, I. I I expected something completely... I expected for just us to say okay and him to fish up. But we actually don't have Demon Ari here anymore. Um, we can just redo that part and like have um, a count and Fox make another baby. Rip Skull Necklace, but we did get another one this run. Let's just hope you return, right? Like, like, like Lux, right? Right. We found the boss fight again. And uh, Ari hasn't returned yet. So I'm genuinely a little worried that we, uh, we like, permanently sacrificed Ari for Ratu. Which I like Ratu, right? And maybe we'll unlock more lore. That would be great. Uh, but also... Um, I really didn't mean to sacrifice Ari because Ari just joined. Uh, Ari, please, if you want to rejoin next episode, like, I will just do that. Like, let's be honest, we can just pretend nothing happened. I, I am fine with pretending nothing happened, and we'll just make another baby next episode. I can't even loop again. Even if I want to, I can't even loop again. Maybe we'll have a bit of story then. Uh, let's see, we did, we did three loops. Uh, are we gonna get a bonus? Look at that. Look at all the defeat. <laughs> Um, yeah, I feel- I do feel kind of bad. <laughs> Continue. It took us only 24 minutes, which is pretty good. Uh, are we gonna talk to anyone? Because we revived Ratu? Nope! Everybody's completely fine. And, uh, only Jonathan Joestar is exhausted, because indeed Ari- Ari is dead. I guess. Um... You completed your quest. Oh, uh, that's why I'm talking to you. I wanted to just kind of put you to bed because you're tired. Not you. You're already going to bed. Uh, and Lux 3 has leveled up. Lux 2 should be back in the cult, I think. Uh, maybe. Lux 2 also has a, has a sleeping thing on, so... I wouldn't know. Count Derpy is here. Is Lux 2 not back? Like, we killed Lux 2, like, multiple times. And then I saw that we absorbed, basically. Maybe Lux 2 isn't back. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on. I just know that we might we accidentally sacrificed Ari. Um, we worked so hard, but I guess we did miss a day. So maybe if we redo it, we can make Ari level five. Um, 
it's not going it's going well like today was an episode where we definitely got the cult back together but also it's not going so well uh so if anyone wants to join i promise you i'm not trying to kill the cult members i promise you i'm also gonna level up real quickly because i just want to get the stone mines level two um i promise not to try to kill you um and um I, I guess we're gonna end this episode here because I've been recording for uh, quite a while. Uh, I I'm waving and you can't see it. Good night, sleep tight. Have a lovely day, evening, and night. Um, leave a like, subscribe if you enjoyed. Uh, leave a comment if you too want to join the cult. I swear, I'm not trying to kill my cult members. Uh, I guess next episode we will try to figure out if anything happened to Ratu and if we can find him at his house. And um, bye. <laughs>